In this video, we will find the equation of motion of a particle under central force. Okay. The motion of a particle under central force is confined to a plane. So, it is convenient to represent it by plane polar coordinate that is given by r and theta. Okay. Now, the equation of motion in plane polar coordinate is given by m r double dot minus r theta dot square r cap that is the radial component plus r theta double dot plus twice r dot theta dot theta cap that is the angular component that is equals to the central force and that is the function of r so that is fr and that force is radial so that is r cap now you have to compare the radial component on both side and angular component on both side so first of all we take the angular components from both side and compare them the angular component to the left side is r theta double dot plus twice r dot theta dot into m that's equals to zero and from this r theta double dot plus twice r dot theta dot equals to zero and we can write this term as dt of r theta r square theta dot okay and that's equals to zero okay now from this r square theta dot that's equals to a constant and we take this constant as h okay and take this as equation number one similarly now we compare the radial component on both side and the radial component to the left side are like this and it is right side so comparing it will get m r double dot minus r theta dot square equals to f r function of r and from this r double dot minus r theta dot square that is equals to f of r divided by m and you take this as equation number 2 ok now we consider a quantity u that is equals to 1 by r and from this r equals to 1 divided by u and from using this in the equation number 1 we get value of r that is 1 by u in theta dot that is equal to h and from this theta dot equals to h u square and now we have to find the value of r double dot in equation 2 so to find r double dot we have to first find r dot that is equals to dt of r ok and we can write dr dt that is equals to dt theta of r into d theta dt that is equals to dt theta of this r can be written as 1 by u that we have considered and d theta dt is theta dot ok now to differentiate 1 by u with respect to theta so that is minus 1 by u square du d theta into theta dot now to put the value of theta dot that is h u square in that case so that is equals to minus 1 by u square du d theta value of theta dot that is h u square and that is equals to minus h du d theta ok now we can find value of r double dot that is r double dot that is equals to ddt of r dot that is equals to ddt of value of r dot that we have get is minus h du d theta that is equal to h is constant so get out of the differential ddt of du d theta that is equals to we can write this term as dd theta of du d theta into 
डी थीटा डी टी ओके दैट्स इक्स टू माइनस एच डी टी यू डी थीटा टू इंटू डी थीटा डी टी कैन एस थीटा डॉट नाउ पुट द फेलो ऑफ थीटा डॉट दैट इज एच यू स्क्वायर सो इट बिकम्स एच डी टू यू डी थीटा टू वैलो ऑफ थीटा डॉट एच यू स्क्वायर एंड इट बिकम्स दैट सिक्स टू माइनस एच स्क्वायर यू स्क्वायर डी टू यू डी थीटा टू ओके दिस वी गेट द वैलो ऑफ आर डबल डॉट नाउ यूजिंग दिस वैलू इन इक्वेशन नंबर टू इन दैट केस वी गेट द इक्वेशन टू लाइक माइनस एच स्क्वायर यू स्क्वायर डी टी यू डी थीटा टू माइनस वन बाई यू एंड वैल्यू ऑफ दिस थीटा डॉट स्क्वायर इज एच स्क्वायर यू टू दर फोर एंड दैट सिक्स टू एफ ऑफ आर डिवाइडेड बाई एम ओके एंड फ्रॉम दिस एच स्क्वायर यू स्क्वायर डी टू यू डी थीटा टू प्लस एच स्क्वायर यू क्यू इक्स टू एफ ऑफ आर डिवाइडेड बाई एम विथ आर नेगेटिव साइन देयर ओके नाउ डिवाइडिंग बोथ साइड ऑफ दिस इक्वेशन विथ एच स्क्वायर यू स्क्वायर वी गेट ओके नाउ दिस इज द रिक्वायर्ड डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन 